This video highlights some of the new and updated features of Brightspace Learning Environment 10.8.10. Assignment Grader no longer supports Edudentity. Login is now completed using Brightspace credentials. A new permission has been added to support the evaluator role. The Edit Evaluation Properties Assignments permission must be set at the organization and course offering levels for evaluators. All roles with the Add Edit permission are automatically assigned the Edit Evaluation Properties permission. Insights Portal has been improved to include a new embedded adoption dashboard, improvements to user experience, and release of the adoption dashboard in Canada. Administrators must have the new Can See Adoption Dashboard permission at all levels and existing query data platform at the organization level. The Base Content Absolute Path value is obsolete for bulk course tools and has been removed. You can now set org-level default settings for indicators in the Class Progress Dashboard and User Progress Report. This feature implements PI Item D2047. The Class Progress Modify Org Default Progress Indicators permission must be assigned to users. Select Class Progress and User Progress. Note. The Modify Org Default Progress Indicators Class Progress Permission must be set at the organization level to access this feature. Here you can select which indicators display by default on the Class Progress Dashboard for your organization. By default, Content Completion, Objectives Completion, Login History for the last 30 days, and Checklist Completion display. To reset class and user progress for all courses, select the Reset All Courses to use these default settings checkbox. Click an Indicators context menu and select Replace. Here you can select another indicator. Assignment datasets have been updated. New columns have been added to the assignment datasets. The Assignment Summary dataset now includes submission type, including the new on-paper and observed in-person values, and completion type columns. The Assignment Submissions dataset now includes a completion date column. The D2L, Tools, Brightspace Datasets, Version, Configuration Variable has been removed. Users currently using Brightspace Datasets Version 1 are automatically upgraded to version 2. New columns have been added to datasets. Award credits has been added to awards and grade release date has been added to grade results. The new enrollments and withdrawals datasets are now available. This dataset provides all enrollment actions from all time across your organization. The Org Units data set has been updated. You are now able to override the type column in the Org Units data set for groups defined as sections. The Can Access Brightspace data sets permission must be set for administrators at the organization level. Manager Dashboard and Learning Groups has been updated. In Learning Groups, when viewing course assignments for individual Learning Group members on the User Details page, only the specific course assigned by the current Learning Group display. Your instructors now have access to the eRater Grammar Checker. eRater Grammar immediately provides feedback to learners on assignment submission.